been to church since probably early March, you might not know that one of the things we've added to our worship space while we've not had in-person worship is hand sanitizer. We actually added it very early on, um, probably the beginning of March. We added hand sanitizer, we put Kleenexes, and we put uh, trash cans. And our hope is that you, if you have to blow your nose, you will use a Kleenex, and rather than carrying that Kleenex around in your pocket and getting it all grubby, you will throw it directly into the trash can, which is right there. And you'll see that we have sanitizer, hand sanitizer, in large quantities in a whole bunch of places. Right now, the hand sanitizer is by the God box on that table. There's one by the prayer station. There's one, um, I think, back by the soundboard. And then there's one by the entrance of the church. We'll also have one as you come immediately into the church. Essentially, anytime you touch anything that is not in your own home, you probably want to be thinking about how soon am I going to wash my hands? How soon am I going to have access to hand sanitizer? It's a good idea to wash your hands. Uh, the CDC does recommend that hand washing is actually the best way of getting rid of the germs. Um, but if you don't have time or if you're in the middle of service and you've touched something and you realized, oh no, what do I do? You just run over to one of the hand sanitizer bottles you just do a little squish, and then you rub your hands together, make sure you spread it all over your hands, and hopefully that will carry you through until the next time when you touch something or the next time when you're able to wash your hands. I pray that you will be able to keep safe and be safe in these days.